Honorable Brown Mumbrile, just to briefly speak to the matters that are important and invite Honorable Acting President to, to comment. Thank you. Thank you very much. Yes, sir, this is a matter where Honorable Given Uganda uh, was charged with the failure to appear before the Presidential Committee of the National Assembly. And uh, he, uh, the lawyers for Honorable Uganda uh, raised the preliminary uh, matter. Uh, we should be, be you know, uh, ruled upon tomorrow. So we're coming back tomorrow for the ruling for the preliminary matter that was raised by the lawyer. Yes, uh, of interest is that the preliminary matter that was raised before court was that uh, under the National Assembly Privileges and Immunities Act, you know, Chapter 12 of the Laws of Zambia, requires that the matter that uh, Honorable Luwinda was appearing before court is tried within a period of one year. You remember this offence is said to have been committed in December 2021 and the matter is way beyond um, one year. So that, I think that was the gist of the submission, that the court, from the operation of the law, had no jurisdiction even to try this matter. We hear how the state will respond tomorrow and how uh, then the court will rule on this matter. Uh, Honorable Luwinda, probably you are the one that has been undergoing these issues. Maybe you can just thank uh, members and encourage especially members of our party that are uh, going through all these, some frivolous, like from the point of law in this case, clearly frivolous charges. Uh, thank you very much. I just want to reiterate what I've always said to members of the Patriotic Front. We are going to live under very difficult circumstances. And I'd like to enjoin all of you members of the Patriotic Front, wherever you are, irrespective of your position. You may only be a ward chairman, but for as long as you are identified as a strong member of the Patriotic Front, you should know that... Uh, you are a potential member of the growing club of members of the Patriotic Front who are being arrested, who are being brought to court every day. The club is growing. And I'm happy that I am a member of that club. So all of you members of the Patriotic Front, be ready. But also I'd like to just encourage you. The reason why you're being brought to police stations, to courts, is because the UPND government know that if they let you free, you are dynamic. You are a standing bomb. They want to frustrate you so that they can have a free reign over Zambia. So my dear brothers and sisters, stand strong. Be ready. We have a team of lawyers who are ready to defend us. There are even other lawyers who are coming on board to come and join the team of our lawyers to defend you. So don't be cowed. Continue to organize. Continue to mobilize the party. Don't be scared. Zambia is for us all. Today here I addressed a central committee meeting because I had more than six members of the central committee. And I took advantage and addressed them. We had a meeting here. We even made, we even made resolutions. Yeah. One of the resolutions we made here is that uh, after my case has been handled, all of us will go now to Woodlands Police. Yes. Because, like I'm saying, every day there will be somebody who is being arrested. Now, as we speak, Dali Solungu is being charged at Woodlands Police. It is arrested. It is arrested so we are going there now to go and give him support. Wherever you hear of any member of the PF who has been arrested, please make sure you inform us quickly. We are going to stand for each other and make sure we defend each other. Because that's the only thing that we have to do for Mother Zambia. If the patriotic front is allowed to be decimated, then I can assure you that democracy in Zambia will be gone. We have to stand for the democracy of this country. All of us who are being brought to court, just hand everything to God. Pray to God because God is watching over us. Thank you very much. Let's meet again tomorrow.